spend a few moments and talk about the intro and the beginning moments of a song by Tom Verlaine from his album Songs and Other Things. It's a song called Blue Light. I'll put a link to it in the description below. Sad to say Tom Verlaine passed away very recently. I was very sorry to see it. Great songwriter, great guitarist, very evocative moods he provoked on albums with his band Television and later a long solo career. There was a point in time when Tom Verlaine and Television were most of what I listened to and I know he's had a great influence on a lot of players. I was happy to see many tributes on social media when he died, a great outpouring of love for him. If you've not yet done so, please do subscribe to the channel. I try to post a wide-ranging topic area every day. Like, share, and leave a comment. If you'd care to leave me a tip, that would be very nice, and my PayPal information's in the description below. So we're going to get going here with Blue Light from Tom Verlaine. Best as I can tell, he's either tuned up a half step, or he's capoed at the first fret. These, uh, there's an intro figure, a second fret to open position. I'm going to talk in relative terms to the capo. That little figure going on, second fret and open. And there's a little overdub guitar on top. It almost sounds like a loop, but I don't think it is. I think he's doing a lot of overdubs on this song, a lot of guitar parts. So this is uh, 15, 16, 15. And then this little line, 15, 13, 13. And then 15, 16, 15, 13. And we get this chordal part then. Now these open strings are what gave it away that it was some kind of, either he was tuned differently or there was a capo involved. So we're going to look at what looks like an A chord. So relative to the capo, it looks like E sus to E. then open, second string open, third string open, and then third fret of the second string, and then second fret of the third string. Then we get this. This would be, now I'll use regular fret numbers because we're up away from the capo. So this is 6th and 4th fret, 6, 4, 6, and he slides up to 8, 7, 8. So, so far, and now we're going to get a little A major 7. So open A, 5th string, 2nd fret relative to the capo, we bounce back to the 5th string, sorry, and then 4th and 3rd strings, 2nd and 1st fret, then we have to get I'll do this on regular fret numbers here. Five, four, five, four, three, five. And we do our same lick. Six, four, six, eight, seven, eight. And then a, a reverse roll. An A chord, second fret relative to the capo. Third string, second, third string, fourth string, fifth string, third string. So 
we have? bunch of guitars come in for the a kind of a another part of the verse B minor just regular B minor relative to the capo it's two four four three two on regular guitar frets three five five four three and then it's just triads a little E minor triad it looks like D minor moved up. I'll call regular frets five, six, four. Then this little five chord uh, on the guitar four, three, three, and then up a half step to G five, four, four, back to F sharp relative to the capo. And then this very interesting major chord that immediately turns to minor. This is uh, on the guitar three, five, five, four. And then we're going to get just these little back rolls. Open, 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 second fret relative to the capo. And again, this little triad on the guitar six, six, seven. And then, best as I can tell, it's a little G major seven chord. Third string open, second fret relative to the capo, third fret relative to the capo. that's of interest worth checking out the whole album is really good uh, his solo records flashlight is fantastic there was a third television album after marquee moon and adventure just called television really worth checking out richard lloyd's on those three records uh, Inventive stuff. Tom Verlaine, an artist who will be missed. Definitely someone who went his own way and wrote very personal songs that seemed to only could have been written by him. So he is greatly missed. I dedicate this little bit to him. If you've watched this far, I do appreciate your kind attention. And as always, I wish you a very good day.